captured on camera running away, leaving a woman trapped in the car, which is believed to have been stolen. Right. There's been a confirmed sighting of two suspected killers who've been on the run in Canada for almost a fortnight. They're wanted over the murders of three people, including Australian Lucas Fowler, with authorities tracking the pair to a town where locals are on edge. This was the moment the Mounties thought they had their men. Yeah. <laughs> Swooping into the small town of Yorkland in Canada, this video believed to be posted by a resident. This, a false alarm, but proof police are taking no chances after a reported sighting of the most wanted duo in the country. Police scrambled from Gillam, Manitoba late this afternoon after a local patrol group saw two men scavenging for food. They believed it was Cam McLeod and Briar Schmigelski. As soon as the guys saw our guys, they bolted. Um, so they, they went across the road towards the lagoon and then uh, disappeared behind into a tree line lake. York Landing is a small community with a population of just 500. A couple of uh, hooded guys walking around the dump shed looks pretty suspicious, right? It would totally stand out. Everybody knows everybody here. The remote town, 200 kilometres from Gillam, is usually only accessed by boat or plane. It can be reached on foot through rough terrain, a journey that would take six days, the exact amount of time since the last confirmed sighting. So maybe they walked. The research tonight is the weather. Constant thunderstorms have been rolling in across the region, bringing with it heavy rain and high winds. At times, it has grounded authorities' helicopters and drones, limiting their capabilities of searching from the air. Locals have been told to remain inside with doors and windows locked until the fugitives are finally found. In Split Lake, Canada, Miley Hogan, 7 News. Back home now.